morning my dear students welcome back to online english grammar class students today we'll be dealing with chapter 13 of english grammar simple present tense i'll be explaining you the chapter in detail so listen to me with concentration let's begin simple present what are verb tenses verb tenses shows the time that an action takes place Simple present is a verb tense. We use simple present tense for repeated actions. Repeated actions have an over and over again. Few examples. I eat breakfast every day. Second one. I read in bed every night. Third one. I always study after school. Verb forms. Simple present verbs have two forms. Base verb verb plus s. Which verb do we use that depends on the subject of the sentence? Subject can be pronouns. subject can be can also be nouns we use base verb when the subject pronoun is i we you etc they also can be used for example i walk to school every day you always drink coffee we sometimes eat dessert they study every night these are few pronouns here yeah? verb plus s we use verb plus s when the subject pronoun is he she or it few examples he reads the newspaper on the weekend she takes the bus to the to work in the morning uh, it sleeps on the couch every day we use base verb when the subject noun is plural Few examples. The, the students take the bus to school. My parents drink coffee every morning. We use verb plus s when the subject noun is singular. The student walks to school every day. My dog always sleeps on my bed. We also use verb plus s when the subject form is uncounted. For example, snow falls from the sky in winter. My hair grows quickly. Now we come to practice part. Let's practice. Answer me students. Few examples. You tell you do your exercise. For example, she dash coffee every day. What will come here in the bracket it is drink. Yes, it is drinks. She drinks coffee every day. And now we come to another example. I dash the bus every day. I take is given in the bracket. What will come here? Yes, I take the bus every day. Your answer will be take. I take the bus every day. Third one. He always dash breakfast. Bracket me kya likha? Eat. What will come here? Eats. He always eats the breakfast. He always eats breakfast. Now we come to another example. Be attentive. They dash to the park on the weekend. What is here given in the bracket? Walk. They walk to the park on the weekend because the noun is plural here and the verb will be singular. So students, another example. The student dash a book every morning. Bracket me kya read. it will be reads the student reads a book every morning because your subject is singular the students dash after school study what will be the verb here study so verb will be singular as your subject is plural so students i hope you must have understood the chapter well try doing all the exercises given to you in the written part and students enjoy doing them i hope you must have understood everything thanks students and have a cool and wonderful day thank you